And I think that's just a necessary thing. We know that China and a number of other countries are using effectively slave labor to undercut the wages of American workers. Donald Trump thinks that has to stop. And again, what Kamala Harris is saying, Kristen, is that if you do this, you're somehow going to cause skyrocketing inflation. In reality, Donald Trump already did it. He brought a lot of jobs back, and it didn't cause inflation. But it caused consumers to pay more. It, it, they paid more in taxes, $80 billion worth. So, do you acknowledge that consumers ultimately will pay more? if there are more tariffs. So imposed. economists- Do you just acknowledge I, that? No, I don't, Kristen, because I think economists really disagree about the effects of tariffs, tariffs because there can be a dynamic effect, right? So what, what some economists will say is, is what you just said, that it will actually raise costs for consumers. But what other people say, and I think the record supports what, what this other view, is that it causes this dynamic effect where more jobs come into the country Anything that you lose on the tariff from the perspective of the consumer, you gain in higher wages. So you're ultimately much better off. You have more take home pay, you have better jobs. And also we have more reliance because one of the things we learned during COVID, I don't, by the way, blame Democrats for this. But one of the things we learned during COVID, Kristen, is that if our supply chains are really brittle, if we depend on the Chinese to make too much of our stuff, then prices can skyrocket at a time of crisis. The economists who say that tariffs are bad, they don't take that into account. And we've all learned it the hard way. And it is economists across the board, really. I mean, the Wall Street Journal says economic data showed that Donald Trump's trade war with China did not achieve its objectives of reversing the declines in U.S. manufacturing or reshoring factory jobs. I hear what you're saying. It's a complicated picture.